In this video, we're going to show you how to complete an around the room circuit and send your answers to your teacher digitally. So your teacher assigned to you two things. They assigned to you on the left hand side um, a copy of the circuit and on the right hand side they sent you a copy or the form for your uh, student recording sheet. That's what you're going to put your answers on and send to your teacher. The first thing we're going to look at is on the left side. This is really important. So we're going to take this right here. We're going to click make a copy and that's going to make you your own personal copy that you're allowed to edit and move things around on. So here it is. It says copy of adaptations around the room circuit and yours will say copy of whatever one you're working on. We're just using this for an example. So on the left hand side here you see all of the circuit slides. Those are out of order. All 20 of them are out of order. You're going to have to put those in the correct order so that you can submit your answers on your Google form. So the first thing that I want to do is I want to notice at the top of each card there's an answer with a letter and at the bottom there's a question with a number. Okay, it doesn't matter what order you go in, you can start whatever order you want. So I'm just going to start with the first one because that's the easiest way to do it. So I don't care about this answer at the top right now, I only care about the question. So it says identify the term that describes a long distance journey that many animal species take on a seasonal basis. If I go through all these cards on the left side, I'm going to go through, I'm going to find the answer. I know the answer to that is migration. Okay, a long distance journey animals take on a seasonal basis. That's migrating, migration. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to say, okay, number 12, the answer was migration, and that's letter I. So on my Google form that my teacher gave me, Okay, I type my first and last name, my email, my class period, and I said number 12 was I. So what I want to do, so I want to go over here, I want to scroll down to number 12, because that's the one that I was working on. It's really important you make sure you do this on the right number, and I'm going to select I. Number 12 is I. Okay, and I'm going to go back to my Google slide. And I'm going to read the next one right underneath migration. What term describes an adaptation that allows an organism to blend in with its environment? Say, okay, blending in with its environment. That's camouflage. So I'm going to go down here. I'm going to put it in the correct order. So there's migration. There is the question. There's camouflage. So number 16, that's the one that I just answered, was camouflage, which is letter P. So number 16 on my Google form should be letter P. All right, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue to go through reading each question. So this would be my next question right here. Number four is my next question. And I'm going to continue to find the correct answers at the top and then go to the next question, the next answer, question, answer, and so on until I put them all in the correct order all the way to the bottom. And what's going to end up happening is this last question down here your answer should be the one that you started with up here at the top. Now that's not the right answer to that one because they're still out of order. But if you do it correctly, it'll create one big long circuit where every single one goes question, answer, question, answer, and you're able to kind of self check and see that you did them all right if they all match up the right way. And you're going to make sure over here that you've selected an answer for all 20 of your questions. Okay, once you've done all 20 and you're happy with your answers, you're going to hit submit and that's going to send your answers to your teacher and you're finished. That's it.